And the other big news that came out that I wanted to touch on with you quickly is uh, before we transition into the show, and that is Saturday Night Wrestling is back, and uh, it's going to be on TNT. Collision has been announced since the last time you and I got together. What do you think about that? Saturday Night Wrestling returns. Well, it's an exciting time for the business. It appears to me that, you know, a few changes, roster changes back and forth here have made it interesting. Now we have another show which will feature more talent that you haven't been seeing, hopefully. And that's going to be interesting. Uh, just that Saturday night format is going to remind a lot of people about, you know, Saturday night wrestling. And uh, we're excited about it. And it, the company and the business entirely is going through another growth spurt. And that can't be a bad thing. It can't be a lot more opportunity, as you said, Arm, for talent to uh, to be exposed and to have an opportunity to wrestle. And uh, it's just uh, what a period right now in wrestling. So much opportunity and uh, another big two hour uh, program for AEW and uh, more opportunity to see you on our television screens, but and so many other talented individuals. So can't wait. Uh, that starts in June, and uh, that's an exciting thing. The other exciting thing I want to touch on as we transition out of the AEW news uh, before we get into this week's topic, and that is Arn Anderson, My Life as Wrestling's Enforcer. It's at the printer following your personal review of the draft. The hardcovers are in process. The paperbacks are available for order. And, dude, we've spent months talking about this project and keeping our listeners uh, appraised of the status as we've received updates from Dirk Manning and his team. But, man, and we're now here. We're at the at the moment, and I can't wait to get my hands on this one, and I can't wait to uh, check it out, buddy. Well, thank you. Me too. You know, I haven't been excited on this level. It's a, it's a different kind of buzz. It's just like Christmas Eve, you know mm -hmm. what I mean? You're getting something you thought you knew what it was going to be, but until you sit down and look it over, you, you're not sure. So uh, uh, hopefully everybody this wants to get one we'll find it and find a place to get one and uh yours will be first on the mailing list there old buddy oh okay man i can't wait but i cannot wait to see it we've been talking about it as i said for so long and now the day is finally upon us so uh, i can't wait to check it out and i know if, if it's anything like they did with shivani's book this is going to be something special uh, because that turned out really nice to have it right on the shelf right behind me. So I cannot wait to see it, Arn, and, uh, and go through it. I know many of our listeners can as well. 